Hey guys, what's going on? Brian here. Today is a bit different in this video because I'm going to be giving away a HANA high range nitrate checker. This one right here. But first, I'm going to show you how to use it, but pay close attention in the video as to how you can enter and win one of these. So let's go. Also, just want to note that this one is mine and the one I'm sending you will be brand new. And the one in the video I'm using to show you how to test is not the one you're going to win. It's gonna be brand new and I have it here ready to ship. Let's do it. Hey you guys, real quick, if you wanna support this channel, the best way to do that is by hitting that subscribe button, hit the like button on this video and leave me a comment down below. Say, hey, this is a cool video, cool tanks, I like it, thumbs up hit the bell notification so that you know when I upload. So this is what I use to collect the 10 milliliters required for the test. I know some people like to use the precision ones that you can grab off of Amazon, but the way I do it, I just fill it up to where the meniscus is at the top of the line for the 10 mil in the HANA test. So the, the most biggest important thing is to make sure that you're putting the right or the same amount of water into the vial every single test. That way you can have it most precise to how you've been testing. Now what you see here is I like to rinse it off into the tank and then dry it off. And that way if there's any type of water spots from the previous test or dust or anything. It won't mess up the test at all when I want a precise reading towards the end. The next step is to get it out of the box and get one packet of reagent. Then you'll want to press the button to turn it on. You'll need a nice sharp pair of scissors to cut the packet. And now you want to put the vial into the HANA checker and get the control by pressing the button to where it says C2. Take it out, open it up, make sure you shake the packet to where all the powder won't fall out as you cut it open. Here you want to use precision cuts on the dotted lines. Now you want to kind of fold it up to where it makes a nice little pouring spout. It makes it a lot easier for it to come out this way and just not plop all out. And it can be added to the vial a lot easier. Now just be careful don't spill it like I just did. That way you get the most accurate results. Always give it a nice little tap after you get the first amount in because there's always some left over in there. Now you want to shake it up for a total of two minutes. All right, guys, so I think it's time that I tell you how to win this checker. Are you ready? All you have to do is be one of my subscribers and comment down below any number, but make sure it's in numerical order. So if someone has one, you go two, someone has two, you go three, so on and so forth. That'd be easier to pick on random.org but also it's two part comment, the number, and then who or what got you into this reefing hobby. I think that's really cool uh, to know your stories of how you started in this hobby. For me, it was, I was just swayed by the passion of it. And then I discovered uh, BRS 360, that series. So I was fortunate enough to catch that series as it was happening. And of course, Coralfish 12G, George. I watched a whole bunch of his videos and he actually taught me a lot along with bulk resupply. So thank you to you guys. Here I am today. But yeah, all you have to do is be a subscriber, comment your number in numerical order, and then tell me your story. All right, guys, let's finish. And make sure you get all of the uh, bubbles out so it doesn't give you a misreading or throw it off any anymore. After that, you wanna press the button to where it shows a timer of seven minutes, let go, and it'll start counting down for you.
And there's our results. 20.2 for the Cade for nitrates. Easy enough, easy test to do. Now, if you wanna win, just make sure you follow the rules, which I put in the middle of this video, maybe towards the end, towards the front, who knows? This is for those that like to skip to the end to find out. Go searching. Always remember guys to just reef. Also just wanna give a huge and big thanks to all of my subscribers. You guys are great. Till next time.